right, so what are we talking about? Kyrie Irving. My son going places, man. He looking like Spurs, Phoenix, T-Wolves, Knicks. And I'm hearing the Clippers was in the mix. That was something that I heard yeah. recently. But to be honest, like, I think I think the Spurs, that's the best, that's the best option because look at what they have already. They already built. They definitely built the win. They got the Hall of Fame coach. My son Kawhi, top three, top two play in the league. The system is crazy. That's, you know what I mean? If I think Kyrie team up with them, click up with them niggas, Warriors is, is quiet. I agree with all that. Why you put Ka Kawhi as the top two player in the league? Cause he gonna go all your best player all right, and all throw right. 30 on your head. So who's one? One is LeBron, right? Mm-hmm. He's better than KD. Oh shit, my fault. I'm just I'm just agreeing. <laughs> I, just, I just had to make sure. I just agree, but nah, nah. KD, KD number one right now. I'm not gonna lie. After that finals, he number one. But you know what I mean? Go Kawhi, Bron, Harden, Curry, Bron whatever. Three now? You think Kawhi better than Bron? Bro, nah, he's bugging, bro. He will guard your best player. So with LeBron. He will guard your best player <laughs> and drop 30 on your head. LeBron has help. A lot of help. Players, coaches, brands, the refs. <laughs> the commissioner. Yo, this nigga is good. But my son Kyrie, you know what I mean? They disrespected my boy in Cleveland. You know what right. I mean? LeBron, he got too much stands. I mean fans. But I mean stands. <laughs> like, my son, like, if if you disrespect LeBron and you want to leave LeBron, all of a sudden you, yeah, you're enough. not loyal. Kyrie, to be honest, I think he's smart for wanting to get out for requesting the trade because if there's all these this talk about LeBron possibly leaving next year, why is Kyrie gonna want to stay? And you saw the way that that front office did nothing this off season, so. I would want to leave too. In a way, like I would, I would want to leave if I was Kyrie. But I feel like he's also being a little ungrateful, and he's also, <sighs> and he's also passing up a lot of cash. He's passing up a lot of cash. Nah, that's true. He's passing up a supermax contract first of all. Just so what? So he don't want to play with Braun, or he's, like, you know, like that's crazy. Bro, I don't like, even think Kyrie worried about money though, right now. That's like exactly. that's the thing. So like he gonna get paid. Regardless, like he got him, but so it ain't money. My thing is like this: still, like, he still, that's still, you know, a super max, you know, like he'll make the most in the league. He could be making the one the most bread in the league, and he doesn't, he doesn't want that because he don't want to play with LeBron. That's crazy. My thing is like the thing is like everybody's predicting LeBron's next move, and you know we all know he's probably gonna slide. But that team right now, when LeBron gone, that's a LeBron type team. Like look, Kyrie can't work with those players, like. Those are players you you know that's gonna pass and cut. Like Kyrie needs somebody that want to score, you know, that's, that want to defend. Like Kyrie would be perfect for like the Spurs. Nah, I mean if Kyrie goes to the Spurs, I agree they could take out the Warriors. But, yeah. But I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna put a bid in for my team. You gotta come to the Knicks, bro. Team up with KP. Ooh, I don't know. He's from New York. Oh, what? Just because yeah, someone from New York don't mean shit. Bro, we haven't had an NBA player come to Dykeman, the Rucker, in a minute, bro. Like, Kyrie gonna be there. there. <laughs> but Kyrie gonna pull up, bro. He gonna make it hot. He gonna make NYC basketball hot. That's what y'all say about everybody y'all wanna tell y'all. Nah, yo, yo, they gonna be hot. Uh, bro, but Kyrie for the culture, like, he got, he already do the jelly. That's what all the kids in New York doing. They jellying everything. They putting jelly on their peanut butter still. Like, <laughs> jellying everything. Like, Kyrie, yo, he got to come to the Knicks, play with KP, put pieces around him. We already got, you know what I mean, T Hardaway, that's a scorer. We don't got a defender yet. We working on that. But we get the pieces in New York with Kyrie, we good. All right, so the Spurs, for instance, they get Kyrie, they one or two in the West. They could be winning the Western Conference. I did want to back, double back on the Spurs because if they get Kyrie, they giving up a lot. They giving up a lot. How much are they giving up? Like, what, is, what do y'all think they giving up? Cleveland going to rob everyone in this trade because no, this, this is the one who won the chip for them. I don't know about that, though, because in this... You could say that Kyrie wants to be out so bad that they trying to take whatever at some point. Nah, you know what I'm saying? I, I, they saying Kyrie not, Kyrie, there's almost no way at this point Kyrie's staying in Cleveland. So if you not getting anything and Kyrie is real disgruntled, <laughs> that word is, I mean, <laughs> then y'all gonna, you just gonna have to take what you could get. So how many years is left in Kyrie's contract? I think he has a two plus one. Two, two and then an option in the third. Two plus years, if I'm Cleveland, 
I'm looking for the best possible option. So if I don't get the best possible option right now, I'm not trading Kyrie. But I don't care whether or whether or not he wants to play with LeBron or not, I'm not giving him up unless if, I get a great offer. If we, if we look at that list again, Phoenix, T-Wolves, the only teams that got like pieces, pieces that I could see. And you know what I'm saying? Like Cleve, um, Phoenix is gonna have to want to give up Josh Jackson. They can't give up Josh Jackson. Exactly. They're gonna. They're not giving up Devin Booker. They can give up Bledsoe though. They could give they up could Bledsoe up. and LeBron the boys. And they can give up picks also. Exactly. That's not Future. enough, bro. Bledsoe and in, picks, in my eyes, that's some bread. That might be enough. But like then we look at the T Wolves. To be honest, they don't need Kyrie because like I would rather see that team already on paper that look good. I would rather see them kind of work. Kyrie gonna add something, but they gonna have to. What they gonna give? They gonna give up Wiggins? Nah, I'll give up Jeff T. Are they gonna have to give up. You would have to give up yeah, Jeff, Jeff, Jeff Teague. Teague and Wiggins. Like that's that's what they want. Wiggins third team and like, I don't know about Wiggins. Yeah. No Wiggins. Oh Wiggins. Wiggins. Remember Wiggins you got know? drafted by Cleveland? Yeah, he did. Went to Minnesota, like, but this is not for a low key like stud. But it could work though, cause the media could flip that. They could flip that into a story like the redemption. Oh, <laughs> nah, I'm coming home. He come, yeah, he come, <laughs> he's coming back. back. Yeah. Come to Cleveland. And LeBron going, yeah, LeBron gonna do what he does with that. But uh, to be honest. Kyrie, like, if he make his way on the Spurs or the Knicks, I can see upside. Right. So here's what I was gonna ask you. I was saying the Spurs in the West, if they get Kyrie, they could represent the Western Conference. Easy. What does that do for the Knicks if they get Kyrie? Where are they? The oh, East? they definitely battle. They battle in Cleveland. They battle LeBron at least until he's out of Cleveland. All right, but there's someone ahead of Cleveland, I don't, and that's Boston right now. I don't. I don't even know, bro. Yeah, like right. Boston look good, but I gotta see something like. Yeah, can y'all compete? Inside. Can y'all compete with Toronto and Washington? With with Kyrie? With Kyrie. And think about considering what y'all might have to give up to get. Because what are y'all giving up to get? Y'all might have you, to give up Hernan you Gomez. Give up that young, that young Hernan European Gomez. core. Yeah, her Hernan Gomez, Cuz, the the other dude, number ninety one. Oh, uh, Kuzminskis. Yeah. Right? Kuzmin oh yeah, the three point shooter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to give him up, and we got to give up Frank. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's that's true. true. Would you be willing to do that as a Nick fan? Yeah. I'm pulling that trigger. Yeah. 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 They gotta give me Kyrie. They gotta give me like a 2025 pick. And they gotta give me like Tate <laughs> Felder, like a, that the the point guard they got. Yeah. That got the bounced. Show one? Yeah, he got I'll bounced. take the show. I'll take the show. But I'm not getting JR Shunt back. It's over. They, yeah. they broke my heart. It's quiet. They can stay over there. But I hear some people say that they wouldn't give up Frank Hernan Gomez for Kyrie. And the argument they make is, oh, this is our young core. I forget, Kyrie is, what, 25? Yeah. Kyrie young too, like. He just graduated. He is the young cause. <laughs> he just so, graduated high school, I mean. All right, so, so y'all in the East, you competing with Toronto and Washington? Yeah. Not next year, but and down the, Bucks. the line. Bucks too, the Bucks. Bucks, Bucks. Too. Uh, the Bucks is dangerous. It's hard, yo, because we don't know what we're getting out the Eastern Conference. Like, these teams, like, like, KP going to be in his third year. He going to get better. Like, the, the players already on the Knicks, I think. These are the guys who actually have something to play for. So they gonna play like everyone in the past, they was just coming here getting money and leaving. Like none of our players have money except for KP and Melo. So, oh, yeah, I give him Melo too, right? Obviously. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's all. I, that's another story. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what's going on. That's a like, weird situation. I don't think Cleveland would take him though. Yeah, I don't think Cleveland Melo would take him. Uh, voice yeah, yeah, yeah. no trade clause unless he's, he's going to so. Houston. They know this is something funny going on over there, bro. That he, I mean, that shit is dead in a year. Yeah. After this year, it's dead. It's quiet, yeah. But Melo, if we that that is interesting. But if Melo go to Houston, I do want to see what we get for him. At the same time, like if we had the ability to pull the trigger on that Kyrie deal, I'm I'm pulling that. Yeah, definitely. I'll give up whoever from Kyrie yeah. from the Knicks. But here's, here's the thing I was going to say about trades. When you're the team that obviously needs to get rid of the player, you're not going to get good offers because people know you're going to get desperate. Look at the whole Melo situation. Y'all been trying to unload Melo for a minute, and the teams know that, so they just trying to weigh y'all out yeah. until y'all get desperate. That's the same thing with Kyrie. He obviously don't want to be there. And you don't want to, what, what's going to end up happening is whoever trades for Kyrie, they're going to get fleeced a little bit. You got to know that. Just like Melo and Denver, that whole nice. trade, they got fleeced. Yeah, yeah, because y'all nice. so obviously trying to unload him. So when it comes to best offer, they're going to have to settle for something. They're not just, they just going to get the right value for Kyrie. So 
Yeah, word. Now, Cleveland, I think they're going to sit on that trade to like the deadline, bro. Yeah. It's not going to happen soon because. So he's just going to play dude. with them the first half? That is it. I don't even know. Like, you know that's you, weird, you right? Has, go, has an NBA player just <laughs> ever held out? Yeah. Like, nah, I'm not fucking with yo, them. You might go nuts. <laughs> you might be like, yo, fuck, bro. You're going to have no X button. If I'm Cleveland, no. X button. Eight button. Eight button. Eight 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 button. Depends what you're playing. Xbox. If you got no pass button. No pass No, he don't got no pass button. So. What would y'all think is the best fit for him? Best fit, Spurs. Best fit? Yeah, I would say Spurs. That's like a championship team right there. If he goes to the Knicks, he's looking like- I mean, they looking for that point guard, so. Yeah, exactly, because that, that brings like Matthew yeah. back to, to the Spurs. And I think they, you know, that challenge to the Warriors, like Pop is going to figure out how to take them down, and then the league is going to follow. Yeah. Like, they, you got somebody who's a finals MVP, and then you got somebody who stabbed the Warriors in the hearts. Yeah. You feel yeah, me? Experience. They team up. They just gonna like they gonna give up a lot, but you know how the San Antonio right. do. They grab they grab people off the you know off the courts like off the streets, and, and <laughs> they put them to work. So because you gotta give that credit to Pop though, because he's like he makes he makes team on um, players play better and make everybody else around them better. Yeah. And that's what you know. That's what I feel like Kyrie. That, that's his problem. He doesn't make everybody else better. You get, you get what I'm saying? Like he like that's why he didn't do that's why he yeah, wasn't gonna play on team in Cleveland. Yeah, he gonna bring his game up. Exactly, he's gonna bring that out. And exactly. And Pop ain't never had like a point guard like that. So what would they give up? I feel like they gonna give up Kyle they Anderson, up Patty Aldridge. Mills, Patty Mills, and Patty Aldridge. Aldridge. Like those is I wouldn't mind things. giving I would up take that. Yeah, I would I would if give I'm up. Cleveland, I'll take that. Patty no, Mills no, no, and Aldridge, I'll even take the that. The Jonte Murray, yeah, tough. He tough. They could give him up, but I know LeBron, I seen like LeBron like like with a vi in a video with this dude. Dance so again? I, yeah, nah, yeah, yeah. some maybe I don't know. He probably dance at the end. He was bold, you <laughs> crazy. Yo, I got the clean beat. But, <laughs> he's acting bold. But crazy. with Murray, they might. I feel like LeBron might ask for him. But he he's a good potential piece. He got mad upside. But they giving up a lot. They they gonna have to give up Aldridge. But the thing is. Cavs gonna have to give us somebody too. They not just giving up Kyrie. They yeah. giving up somebody too. If I'm Cleveland, I get um, Lamarcus. I might give up Kevin Love. Damn, so you give up Kyrie and Love? Yeah. That's old, but that's not. But for real, though, like, for Lamarcus and like and we you said Murray, uh, Patty Mills, Patty Mills and Anderson. Maybe it take like another. Slow maybe take a pick from the Spurs. Also, I'll take that. I feel like I feel like LeBron will make Le, uh, LeMarcus Aldridge better. On some shit. The yeah. Spurs don't gamble like that, so we might. They, yeah, the Spurs yeah. don't even gamble like that. That's so it's true, like so. we don't know. You know, it, it's still up in the air. But to be honest, the best fit, Spurs. Second, you know the Knicks. Why you gonna say the Knicks? Nah, maybe the Timberwolves low key though. Ah, they don't I, need him. If they get rid of Jeff Teague and they make they run the ball through Jimmy Butler and Kyrie, you get rid of Jeff Teague, you put Kyrie in that position. Now. Kyrie is like the shooter they don't have right now. Exactly, they, they need a shooter. Right. I was thinking sure. that because Jeff Teague's definitely not gonna be that shooter for you. Um, I still feel like um, Kyrie got you know is a better um, playmaker than than um, Jeff Teague. Sure, and that's what you were saying recently. You were saying they don't got no playmakers yeah. in Minnesota, and that's the thing. Like Kyrie won't work in Minnesota because like Kyrie playmaking isn't necessarily passing. Not his playmaking is like getting a bucket. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's his playmaking. He makes it happen. Yeah, he, he gonna create, create a shot. shot. That's a play. Shot, yeah. you know? But Kyrie not gonna get Jimmy more shots. He's not gonna get Carl Anthony Towns more shots. And if Wiggins still there, but you also never you know, they're yeah. not gonna get crazy. But they will dominate games because of that talent, that, that young talent. They gonna dominate games. And you also you can't forget they also got Tom Thibodeau as their coach. You know you can't you can't yeah. neglect that he, fact either. Yeah. You know I mean? He's also a great coach and he knows defense yeah, first. Yeah, he might make he'll make Kyrie a better defender. He'll make but. That, I don't know. I feel like they, he plays team ball. He runs the like they run the system too. You feel me? Like yeah, they'll be able to move do. the ball around. And you know I think they'll be that'll be a good fit for them and they'll be a better team than what they got right now with Kyrie. Think that's better than the Knicks. I just think that's yeah, way better than the Knicks. Chill, chill, chill. Nah, yeah, bro. I just think that's just yeah, throwing you. You just throwing too much on that T Wolves team, man. They, they doing too much. You can't have too much. Look at the Warriors. Yeah, the Warriors. No, I'm not exactly. talking about like, like in terms of like just throwing play. Like I feel like you put in too much, like too much unmeasurable talent. I guess that's what I want to say. Okay, so at least the Warriors. Mess. Look at the Warriors players. Like all of those dudes is unselfish. Like all of those dudes, if they on another team. I don't even count them as being a star player except for Stephen KD. 
nah, on that team. Nah, I take Draymond be- as a star player. Nah, yeah. Draymond not gonna be a star on another team. He's gonna be an exceptional like role player, like he is already. Clay, same thing. Clay not gonna create a, not gonna just come up and create. Uh, well, to me, I got the Spurs, the T Wolves, and then the Knicks. If we looking at fits. Best fit, Spurs. Second, Knicks. Oh, the Wolves the third. Go Still gonna go with the Knicks. Are they a playoff team though? Like if they if the Kyrie goes to the Knicks right now, is he, are they are they even in the AFC? In the East, yes. They just they like the six seed. <laughs> what? In the East. I mean, I would put Toronto, Washington ahead of them. Still. Yeah. Right. And Milwaukee and then Cats. Philly's gonna come up. Philly. Exactly. Milwaukee. So the Heat. No. <laughs> no. They nah. almost made the playoffs last year. Nah, nah, nah. I don't believe him, not yet. That's personal. It's <laughs> <laughs> hate. Hey, you know, the heat. Yo, chill. I think that he should take, they should, they should make a move for Kyrie, though. I mean. Who they give up, though? They don't really got no pieces. They got yeah. Goran Dragic. I don't even think they want him. I heard that, like I said, the, the rumor about them making an offer that was false. Yeah, of course, yeah. Why, your sources. Uh, why y'all think no <laughs> Why Kyrie don't want to play with Bron? I say this. LeBron. He brings you to a chip every year. He brings your talent and your value. Like he keeps it stagnant or he bring he drops it. Look at look at his forwards he played with. Bosh, Kevin Love. Kevin he's Love a star. He's no a star on the other team. On Bosch another team, no Bosh was a star. Yeah. Kevin Love is a star. But what did they do when they went with LeBron? Exactly. They had to, right now I'm agreeing with you. They had to be stagnant. They had to suppress their game. D Wade, he had the he went crazy that first year. They was playing well. But then I heard like that in the conversation they said, yo, you want it's your team. Like, yes, yes, yeah, yes. something like that. So like LeBron don't necessarily bring your game. Like he don't bring a game to that next level. Like in Kyrie, his game is already growing. Like when he was by himself in Cleveland, that's the thing. People take like, oh, Kyrie wasn't doing this by himself. Kyrie ain't take Kyrie. a team to the playoffs. Kyrie, Kyrie was, was a, first a senior game. in college yeah, age like, at that yeah. point. He Still. just passes us ATs, like, <laughs> second year, 19 years old, they talk about when he was a star, and then when the LeBron came, LeBron came after he signed an extension, when they realized, like, yo, Kyrie's that guy now, like, he's actually becoming a man, and you know what I'm saying, and Kyrie's such a killer, like, LeBron passed the ball to him in the fourth, like, yeah, and, and, and an assist, oh, triple-double, no, like, my, my son is giving you that assist, like, come on, like, give him credit, too, like, and that's the thing, too, like, I think Kyrie might have left, or, you know, his decision to wanting to leave is based on low-key credit, and also just, like, he knows he don't need LeBron. Because yeah. you don't get enough credit. Yeah, that's what I, I think I read somewhere, I can't name my sources, because, no, no, <laughs> like, nah, like, like, what you would call it, um, when LeBron was saying, oh, I need a playmaker. Like, you caught, like, yeah. why when y'all lose, it's it's all of a sudden LeBron needs help. And then when they win, it's like LeBron is, you know, the reason they win. Like, come on. Like, Kyrie didn't just drop 30. Yeah. Like, he ain't average. Like, what, he had, like, 25 plus in the playoffs. Like, so LeBron did, did it by himself. Like, come on, yo. Yeah, I was reading somewhere that he said, like, he was talking about like he he didn't feel like he didn't ask for LeBron like LeBron just came to him like he like he wanted to do this like pretty much on his Coming own. Home. <laughs> and, like LeBron out of nowhere came home and he was like oh shit. So like, I guess like I guess maybe he feel resentment to like for like you know they get all that attention he feel like he didn't get the attention yeah, he deserved the, the credit that he deserves. And also I I seen I seen a clip it was like oh how LeBron been a father figure to you or yeah, something yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. Like, they did like they try to make him like they got Kyrie being sunned out. Yeah, there son, yeah. I, I don't think he I think he ain't been the same on, thing. He was like what he was like yeah, what? He's about, like he's about pops. he a pops now yeah, like, right. like, <laughs> like you know what I'm saying they ain't do that to D Wade like he takes. Everything is LeBron's team when he's there. Yeah, it's true. It don't matter where he go, what was established prior, he goes there and it's LeBron's team. And I get it. That's playing the world. That's playing the world, word. But. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs>